Uh, good afternoon, members of the Upper Staff of North Well Link. My name is Jared Turner, and you have approached me on the basis of uh, what's currently undergoing in North Well Link and what needs to be changed, and you want my opinion. Uh, for this, we will be focusing on the recent developments within North Well Link in the past five years. Uh, we will be using TG's Technical Political Cultural Framework Model, also known as TPC, for this analysis. Throughout, throughout this uh, presentation, we will be outlining the situation at North Well Link and why there needs to be change, as well as we'll be briefly outlining the changes that need to be made as well as our conclusions. So, first things first, the problem at North Well Link. Well, the major problem is that in the past five years, percentage of sales has decreased drastically uh, from around... from around 12% to 5% in the last five years. It is also uh, haven't undergone any new iterations or innovation in terms of new products. And as such, these sales are also down as well. Um, on top of this and our reduction in sales percentages, key competitors with Northwell Inc. are very rapidly catching up and exceeding us. So in aspects such as reducing costs, uh, sales percentages, and all sorts of other things. The good news is, is that despite these advantages that uh, our competitors are undergoing, Northwell Inc. is still very much a trusted and respected provider of medical instruments. So we can use this to our advantage. However, competitors have caught up, they are exceeding us. Uh, most of them have already, already introduced some form of online uh, communication and sales where we at Northwell have not. So what did we do to try and prevent, uh, try and you know, correct that? Well, the current thing that Northwell underwent was a joint project with Medichair uh, to create basically an online marketplace for their products. Um, it was grand in scope and it was set to deal with many deals, uh, deal with many of the problems that Northwell had, uh, mainly the one where they had no online market penetration at all, or any online presence. However, now this is the reason why I'm here, is that this online market has undergone several drawbacks uh, and has, is way behind schedule. So, and um, it has caused several withdrawals of key members of staff and as well as uh, key partners with Northwell Inc. So if change does not happen, we are in a very dire state at Northwell Inc. So, now that we know what the problem is, we'll be going on to the diagnostic model that I have chosen to use for this situation. So, the model I have chosen is the TPC model, as you know. Uh, the focus of this model is that change can be effectively managed by considering the technical, cultural, and political aspects of the surrounding market environment and organization. So basically we are focusing uh, and it also focuses on the driving forces behind these changes so that we can better understand you know what's helping this change, what's not helping this change and like holding it back and how and this model allows us to see that and then reinforce the changes, uh, the driving forces that are pushing the change and reduce the ones that are uh, holding back the change. So, with this model, what we hope to achieve is that uh, a desired state within the organization, and then with this, we can analyze all perspectives of the surrounding environment, see the driving forces, and then uh, mold the change accordingly. So, with the diagnostic model, we have come to the analysis. So what does this model tell us when we have used it as our analysis? So, there are a huge amount of environmental factors that require Northwell Inc. to change, and to change very rapidly. Um, one, the, the key one is technological. Recent innovations in online and internet technology have given Northwell the opportunity to penetrate a wider market. However, 
it has not done so, simply focusing on this online market as the overall solution. This has led to some extreme drawbacks because of the complications behind this project. So it is not taking advantage of that technological aspect and it is falling behind. Another one is that key competitors are catching up, as you know. They are reducing their costs, they're providing better, uh, better supplies, better quality, uh, reduced prices. Those are, those are some big driving factors to that we need to change right now. So, the analysis also shows is that Northwell Inc. has put too much focus and stock in this online market and as such has had huge, huge drawbacks in other parts of its company. So we've got losing, uh, we've got losing staff, we've got losing uh, valuable partners within the organization. Innovation has suffered, sales have suffered, uh, nothing has been done to reduce prices within Northwell Inc. So Northwell needs to change its focus. Its focus should not just be on this online market project. They need a solution and they need it now. They can't wait for the project, but something needs to be done. So, with that in mind, what are the things they should be changing right now? What are the next steps? Well, the next steps is that while they are waiting on Medicheck to finish their part of the online market and to get it up and running, there needs to be some kind of online, uh, online uh, way of communication and sales. So I propose is that first things first is that they should put the Medicheck project on the back burner for a bit. They should instead focus on providing a much smaller a uh, temporary online solution to broadcast to new markets. They should also focus on bettering their internal structure, reducing costs, setting up new infrastructure for these new markets that the online, uh, that the online market project will no doubt only open up, such as international, um, as well, uh, so that they can catch up with competitors. They are way behind with competitors. They need to focus and try to get back that advantage they once had in the market. As well, I might suggest that the project scope for the online market with Medicheck needs to be reduced in size as it is pushing the current boundaries of technology and as such has encountered these drawbacks and whew, these delays in its final procedure. So, in conclusion, Northwell Inc. is under great duress because of the large amount of focus it has had put into one singular project within the business. This is a terrible move as they should always be focusing on side projects or backups if things go wrong with this project. They have put too much time, resources, everything into this project and now that it's failed and been delayed, they have nothing and are even falling further behind. So many, uh, Northwell needs to change their focus on betterment of their own structure. And I would also recommend strongly that they should focus and develop their own online solution while waiting for this Medicheck project to complete. Thank you very much for your time. Have a good day.